Welcome back everybody. Uh, today I want to show you my January Ipsy bag and the theme for this month was 19 reasons and and you can fill out this part. Um, it's part of a giveaway I think to win a year subscription. But let's uh, move on to the bag itself. Uh, not that exciting. It's just this blue bag with um, these beauty products on it and the bag smells horrible horrible so that was a big complaint but um, the color is not really showing up the same on the camera as it is here it's more of like a aqua blue and here it looks like it's a light blue uh, apologize it is the horrible lighting but let's get into the products because that's what you are watching the video to see. So the first thing I got was this skin smoothing or soothing and smoothing eye cream. And it reduces the appearance of puffiness and fine lines. Never tried anything from this brand, but I will give it a go. The size is one fourth of an ounce. And I'll try to figure out the um, total value of this bag and put it somewhere on the screen or down in the um, description below. So it's the first item. This uh, second one I got was this um, Malin and Go Goez Goats Mojito Lip Balm. Um, I like lip balms, so uh, this is another item I will keep and try for myself. Last month, I gave away all the items because I hated everything. So I at least have some items I can use this month. Um, this is a daily protection soothing treatment fatty acid absorption technology, and it is 0.35 ounces. I uh, never heard of this brand, so hopefully it's good and doesn't taste gross. Um, Mojito makes me think it's going to taste like minty, maybe. Uh, next is this um, leave-in conditioner from Healthy Sexy Hair. I love sexy hair brands. My favorite was the, uh, from this line, was the pumpkin that they had several years ago. Um, but I haven't seen it, so I guess it was discontinued. After, I think it was only available for that one... Um, uh, brief time, but I loved it so much. It smelled so good and the conditioner was awesome But this is the soy and cocoa and I've tried the um, I think it was like an argan oil from this line um, So I'm very excited to try this out and this is a 1.7 fluid ounce I think this is the travel size yeah, um, currently the only other product I have from Sexy Hair is the Straight Sexy Hair, the, the Shine Spray, which I absolutely love. It's the, in the pink and gray or silver can. Next is Elizabeth Mott, bleh, Elizabeth Mott Smooth Shadow Creamy Eye Pencil. Again, I've never heard of this brand, but that's okay. Uh, it's not really a color that I would normally reach for. Um, it's in the color Penny. But I figured um, if I wanted to do like a neutral or nude eye look that um, it would be cool. It is very shimmery, like metallic, like a Penny. I don't know if it, you can tell in here. So, yeah, just... Uh, Nude, and it went on very smooth. Um, the tip is very thin. It's more like an eyeliner than um, switch hands. It's more like an eyeliner than a, what I would expect from an eyeshadow stick. Because um, like the NYX jumbo pencils, those are you know a lot fatter than this. But I'll show you how it goes on. So yeah, it's it's goes on nicely so I will give it a try so 
This is not my favorite bag, but at least I'm not going to be giving away everything in the bag. And next was, whoops, well, I got four of these Proactive Mark Fading Pads. Never tried anything from the Proactive brand, but I do struggle with uh, adult acne. So I'm more than happy to give these a try and hope it will help my skin in some way. So, yeah, so we got those. The Elizabeth Mott. There's my eye soothing cream. And my lip balm. And my healthy sexy hair. So that's what I got for this month. Not amazing or exciting, but still products that I'm going to give a try. So uh, let me know what you got in your bag this month and if you liked it. Um, if you aren't signed up for Ipsy, you can use my referral link in the description box. I will greatly appreciate it. Um, Thanks for watching and I'll see you next month with the February FCA.